out of here. We're done with you. Yeah. <laughs> now we need our drink. <laughs> All right, so we have Michelle. She's from Rose's Daughter, which is the new restaurant in downtown Delray Beach. It is by the owner and chef of Brulee, yes. Suzanne Perotto. And um, I have to tell you, the food is phenomenal at Rose's Daughter. And apparently the drinks are. Where's it located in Delray? Sure. It's right in Pineapple Grove. Mm -hmm. It's about a block um, further south from Brulee. So Got it. Same road, right around the corner. It's the old Max's Harvest. Right. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We have two bars. We have a beautiful outdoor Ooh. patio. You and fancy. They are oh, fancy. fancy. So this That's sounds true. a lot larger than Brulee. Um, it is a little bit larger yeah. than Brulee, a little bit of a different layout, but um, it's an open concept, open kitchen. It's really and a who fun is time. Rose? Roby wants to know. So Rose is Chef Suzanne. Yeah. Um, her mom, Linda Rose, had a um, restaurant in New York City where she actually started becoming a chef and learning about culinary and um, cooking when she was 14. This wow. was in New York, and her mom is Linda Rose. So this restaurant is really an homage to her mom, Linda oh. Rose. So, so she Rose's is daughter, Rose's daughter is yeah. Chef Suzanne. So when it's an homage, is it some of her recipes? Is it's, it just um, themed after what she would like? There's actually a lot of family photos in the restaurant, which is really unique. We have a lot of um, vintage plates and things like that that are family heirlooms. heirlooms yeah. And also um, a lot of the recipes are inspired by her nice. mom as well. Yeah, the food is, it's Italian. It's an Italian oh, tutorial okay. yeah. and it's delicious. We're a complete scratch kitchen. So everything's yeah. made in house from our mozzarella to our bread Pasta, that is yeah, amazing. Our, all our pastas are pappardelle, ravioli, limoncello, oh. all our cocktails. So. Yeah. It's All right, so what are we dangerous. making today? So today I'm making for you guys um, a cocktail called the Le Passion, oh, which means passion, passion in Italian. Ooh. Yes, okay. and it is made with Zacapa rum, uh -huh. chinola, which is a passion fruit liqueur, mm -hmm. and fresh pineapple juice. You know, we've had a lot of rum drinks lately. I feel like rum is making a comeback. Well, rum South is Florida. I mean, did rum yeah. ever go away in South Florida? I think so. I think rum has just become a little bit more elegant. Yes, yes. yes. It's like up and in. I, well, yeah, Jen gin's always been elegant. It's just younger people or are, are yeah, drinking finding it. it. What happened but I to will tequila, Michelle? Well, tequila's there. Don't you worry. Okay, good. <laughs> tequila's one of my. What favorites. is your yeah. drink? So my drink, um, it's hard. It's hard for me to go out and order a drink because oh, um, yeah. you know I'm used judgy. to making my drinks. Yeah. And, um, if there's and something no one makes off, it as good I'm like, as oh. <laughs> so I usually drink wine when I go out. But if um. I'm behind the bar or if I can access behind the bar somewhere. I'll whip something up real quick. Yeah. So um, depends. I do love tequila, but um, this drink is great also with rum. So you have rum, then you have chinola, and what is this? This is fresh pineapple juice. Oh. All our juices are fresh, um, squeezed. Everything is just. I great. still don't believe they're out there squeezing that. You're out juice. there squeezing oh, it. Squeezing you were out there yeah. this yeah. morning yeah. squeezing it. Yeah. on in the top, and I'm just sitting there squeezing. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> it's a blended smash. And yeah. Make it happen. Okay. All right. We want to try this. Yeah, yeah. Let's do it. It's um, it's an excellent drink. It's really nice and refreshing. I think you guys are really going to enjoy it. Ooh. So do you add ice or is it? I do. Um, there's some ice oh, you, shaker oh, right here, and I'm okay. going to give it a nice shake. Unlike you, Roby. I know. He forgets to put ice in. And then I shake it without ice. I did that one time. <laughs> that was like, something's wrong. Something <laughs> doesn't sound right. No, but this is a great cocktail. It's very refreshing, and um, it's definitely one of our top sellers for sure. Oh, yeah. So it's just not a 9 a.m. drink. Oh, it can be. It yeah, can be. Yeah, but I mean, like, you can drink this well into the night and still Keep it's going to feel it. Yeah. yeah. So I hope you guys enjoy it. Wow. Is there a garnish? There is. Yes. Okay. Sure. Suzanne's I always grabbing. Ask. Yeah, she's always um, grabbing for the garnish. And our garnish, what's great about it is it comes right from our back patio where oh, we have scared. all of our herbs Ooh. growing for the oh. restaurant. So this is a little Basil? bit of a lemon balm, actually, oh. um, which is an excellent little okay. garnish. Cheers. And um, I hope you guys enjoy. Ooh. Cheers. Even these glasses are fancy. Mm -hmm. Fancy coupe glasses. Oh, my God. That's really good. Yeah. I don't taste... The, the rum at all, it's or the a, liqueur. It's a little magical gift I have of disguising the alcohol. But well, that's you, Suzanne's oh, way of saying, He's, I need a heavier hand. You still have it. <laughs> no, it's, it's, that's a dangerous thing. Yeah. <laughs> that's a promise. It's all a, right, well, thank you, Michelle, for Rose's pleasure. Daughter. Go check them out and Just ask them. for the La Passion. You know what I like about this? It's yeah. not too sweet. It's definitely yeah. not too yeah. sweet. Yeah. It's just the right balance. Yeah, so. All right. Thank, thank you, you. Wow. so much, guys. What a